There are new updates to share in the manhunt for Danilo Cavalcante. These images seen here were taken on a trail cam at Longwood Gardens last evening. Now, Longwood Gardens was closed over the weekend because of this manhunt, but they did reopen yesterday under an abundance of caution. However, Tuesdays, they are often closed, so they are closed today, and now police are searching Longwood Gardens to see if they can spot Cavalcante there. Police have said that his appearance remains unchanged. He's five foot tall, weighs about 120 pounds, and has shaggy, long brown hair. So he hasn't cut his hair or anything like that. However, they have said, and as you can see in these trail cam photos, he was able to pick up an extra bag, according to police. And there is a resident in Copson Township who believes that Danello was in his home on Sunday and took food out of the kitchen. Here is what Longwood Gardens has shared on their website. Now, in another video, I mentioned that I actually have my wedding photos taken at Longwood Gardens. It's a thousand plus acre botanical garden site. They also have several buildings such as a greenhouse. Um, they also have tree houses on the property. It's a beautiful place and people come from all over the world to visit it. So the fact that Danello might be roaming these grounds, it is definitely going to be a Herculean task for police to locate him, but I'm sure they are fully equipped to do so. The other update is that two school districts either closed or went to virtual learning today because of the continued manhunt. And when police realized that Danello had been captured on the Longwood Gardens trail cams, they realized that they needed to move their search a little bit. So they are doing that today and hoping to narrow in on him. They have also again said that residents need to be very vigilant Keep doors locked, vehicles locked, even if you're home. Make sure you're taking precautions. If you see anything suspicious, report it to police. If you are in this area and you're seeing my video, let me know how you're coping with this and handling this. I was especially thinking of the residents who were hearing the helicopter broadcasting the message from Danello's mother yesterday and just what a disruption that must have been to hear that all day as you're trying to, you know, go about your life. So let me know how you're handling it. And, um, you know, everyone hang in there and let's hope that he is caught soon.